guys, for today's lesson, we'll be um, tackling venipuncture using um, this arrange method and your ETS, all right, or your evacuated evacuated tube system. We'll also tackle um, skin puncture, okay? So, um, first thing you have to do is to uh, correctly identify the patient. So, to do that, you'll need the um, laboratory request and then you ask the patient to state his or her name verbally. After verifying the patient, um, you introduce yourself as the medical technologist for the day and then um, you simply state um, what kind of test the patient will be having and what kind of procedure uh, you'll be performing okay so let's start so for this day um, I have my friend here to help me with this uh, procedure all right so uh, good morning ma'am kindly state your name good morning um, I am Camille Kate Vika Tailo yes and birthday ma'am um, July 11 1998 all right so make sure that the uh, name and birthday she stated uh, corresponds with the lab request all right so um hello ma'am i'm farida maybe wong your medical technologist for today so uh for today uh you have a request for cbc so i'll be performing um venny puncture on your arm put your gloves So as you can see, I've already prepared my things here. So first step you have to do is to apply your tourniquet. So um, it should be applied within one minute and then two to three inches above the anticubital fossa. Alright. And then next you have to palpate for the vein. So the bow we have um, three veins available here. We have the median, of course, the cephalic, and the basilic. So our first choice will be yes, correct, your median, and then next um, priority will be your cephalic, and then your basilic. All right. So I'll have to pipe, pa uh, palpate the vein. So ma'am, kindly make a fist. All right. So after um, finding your vein of choice. Um, clean the site with an alcohol swab or a wet alcohol and then the cleaning should be um, from the inside towards the outside okay to prevent um, the uh, contamination all right so dapat with force niya guys sa okay, para mawala jud ang mga dalik dik dira ni patient all right dayon ayon ninyo lang tawag guys okay ayon ninyo judge si patient if ugaw siya ko an kamo and then um, prepare your uh, uh, needle or your syringe. So we'll be using the 3cc. As you can see, there is a gap here. All right. So um, don't forget to tighten that. And then release any pressure. So guys, dapat dili na to paypayan ang koan guys sa ang arm or taihupan dapat um, air dry lang jud ang ato ang side. Okay. So, while waiting, prepare your um, tape with cotton. Okay, so I think that's dry. So, ma'am, mutusok na ko, ma'am, ha? So guys, ayaw mong panik ha, if wala koan, if wala mo nakahit da yun, dapat calm or jud mo, and then trust in your skills, ganun. So, remember to, uh, kuhaon sa unang tourniquet, usa ang needle, alright? Okay, so ma'am, kindly press the um, cotton for at least 2 minutes, okay? And then, transfer your blood sample. Two, 
don't forget to thank the patient guys and then um label the tube in front of the patient okay so don't forget to invert it eight times five six seven eight okay dapat hinay ang pag invert guys sa dili ana kay mahimulay sa atong sample and then um once again ask your patient unsa yang name and birthday to verify if siya ba jud inyong nakuan okay so unsa tong name ma'am Camille Kate Vicatayno all right so dapat in siyang i-label in front of the patient birthday na to ma'am July 11 1998 proper patient care dapat ayog kalimot na ipapress ninyo ang cotton for at least 2 minutes okay so thank you so much ma'am um kindly press the cotton for at least 2 minutes to stop the koan the blood flow okay so